Greetings friends, you are watching A True Taste of Heaven, brought to you by A Touch of Faith Ministries. My name is Dorothy, and today we're going to be demonstrating one of my favorite dishes in the world. It's the massage kale salad. Now I like that dish because it is so good for you, it is so easy to make, and of course, it's so delicious. Now to make the massage kale salad, the number one ingredient that we're going to need is, of course, you guess it, kale. So I invite you to come with me so we can go to the garden and harvest some kale. How's that? Let's go. growing here but we're looking for kale right so we can see we have this beautiful cabbage that is definitely ready to be harvested we have basil we have this kind we have a couple varieties of kale we have this one right here and then we also have this kale but I really like to use this type of kale for my massage kale salad so that's what we're gonna harvest today when, I'm not sure if you guys are familiar with harvesting kale, but basically you kind of go at the end of the stem and you break it, just like that. At the end of the stem, you start with your large leaves that are ready to be picked, and then you just harvest them, just like that. And the amazing thing is that it's gonna continue to grow. As you can see, it, it grows from the middle. So do we harvest on the side, it's gonna keep growing and keep growing. That's the beauty of kale. And kale is one of the best foods out, out there in the world. It is so full of nutrients. It just has protein, iron, potassium, calcium, and many other minerals. So we definitely encourage you to include kale in your diet. We're gonna get a couple more leaves here. Then we'll be all ready to go. So we have our kale. We're gonna just make a one person salad today. So let's go back to the kitchen and get this going. Follow me back in the kitchen and we're gonna get this going. So, we're now in the kitchen. We went ahead and we washed our kale. Just make sure that when you're washing your kale, especially if it's organically grown or if you grew it, if you grew it yourself in your backyard, make sure that you pay attention closely to the leaves because often a lot of little insects can be hiding um, in diverse places in these in these grains. You definitely wouldn't be tasting your kale salad. So here are the ingredients that we're gonna use today. All of the ingredients we have about six, we have our kale here that was washed about six to eight leaves of kale this is a one person dish so six to eight leaves of kale we have a tablespoon of cold pressed olive oil extra virgin olive oil definitely we would recommend cold pressed olive oil because it's not processed as regular olive oil and in if you instead of olive oil another thing I like to do is adding using um, half of an avocado or a quarter of an avocado instead of the olive oil. So, our kale, one tablespoon of olive oil, two tablespoons of freshly squeezed lemon juice or lime juice, and then we're gonna use two tablespoons of honey, and we're gonna use some cherry tomatoes for decoration because they're just so beautiful, and also to add to the nutritional value of our dish, and definitely some purple onions. So let's get started. So we have our kale, we're going to go ahead and pour our olive oil on it, our lemon juice, we're going to get our two tablespoons of honey. Now if you prefer your salad to be more on the savory side, you can put about one to one and a half tablespoon of honey instead of two. And then you can add a pinch of salt if you want it to be more savory. Ooh, a little bit too much here, Dorothy. Okay. So we have that our honey and then this is the fun part about the salad as the as the name says massage kale salad so this is a salad that you're gonna massage so make sure your hands are clean or you can use gloves so here we go we're gonna massage it Ooh. and this is really the beauty about the salad this the massage part is very crucial 
because it make as you massage the kale with the with the lemon juice and the oil or the avocado and perhaps a little bit of sea salt it really helps make the leaves very very tender to the point that someone may try it and may think that it's cooked but in reality it's a raw dish it was not cooked it's just your hands have massaged it so much that the kale has become really tender so we massage and massage. Take a look. See how, you know, this big bowl of kale that we had is slowly decreasing in size. Slowly decreasing in size. And it's becoming more and more tender as I massage it. So go ahead, put your hands in there and massage your kale. So much love put into one dish. Isn't that wonderful? So now that we have massaged our salad, our kale, we're just going to add the last ingredients. Now we have the cherry tomatoes. You can choose to keep them whole or you can slice them in two or you can do both. For this video, I'm going to do both. I'm going to have some cherry tomatoes that were sliced in two and some whole ones. And then we're going to add our onions. And the onions and cherry tomatoes you can add based on your taste. If you like a lot of them, then you can add a lot. If you don't, then you add as much as you want. And then we mix it all up, we stir it all up. And ta-da! We're done with our massage kale salad. So let's take a look at the final product. So we are all done. Wasn't this super easy, guys? I mean super easy and super quick you do not have to be a chef to make this salad and it's just so good for you and so delicious and as I said in the beginning if you would like the salad to be more on the savory side we invite you to cut, cut back a little bit on, on the honey that you add instead of two tablespoons so you may use one to one and a half and put a little bit of sea salt and a little bit of garlic powder but if you like me you would like it to be more sweet than Go ahead, use two tablespoons of honey. So now the only thing that is left to complete the salad is to give it a taste. So let's take a look. I mean, this looks so gorgeous. I don't want to touch it because it's just so beautiful. But at the same time, just looking at it makes me really hungry. So we're going to go ahead and give it a try. Mm-mm. Do you see these beautiful greens? Oh, yes. I want a cherry tomato on this. Mmm. Now that is a super delicious salad. Mmm, this is so good, guys. You definitely have to try this. Today to all our videos. No, that's not what I wanted to say. Sorry, not.